the Attorney General in Nigeria Statistics states have sold the Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Abubakar Malami, for non remittance of stamp duties found generated from the states. According to a court document, the attorney sued Malami because funds generated from stamp duties are not remitted into states' coffers. People's Gazette reports. They sought an order of the court to mandate Malami to pay 176 billion naira for the backlog of stamp duties received between 2015 and 2020. Document rates in part an order of this honorable court directing the defendant to pay over to the plaintiffs all the sum of monies amounting to 176 billion 67 million 400 thousand naira representing ascertained and admitted collected stamp duties on individual persons transactions within their respective states you know for the period of 2015 and 2020 and thereafter till the time of the judgment of this honorable court of any other sum as the plaintiffs may be found entitled by the honorable court the attorneys general also sought an order of perpetual injunction restraining the defendants by himself private agents or any person by whatsoever name or howsoever called from appointing anyone for the purpose of collecting stamps duties on individual persons transaction within the respective states of the plaintiffs henceforth the further sought to declare that malami had no right to withhold stamp duties transactions from individuals in their states in the document they argued that malami should not be allowed to collect administer or collect stamp duties a declaration that the defendant is not entitled to collection administer or keep the proceeds of any stamp duties on transaction involving individuals within the respective states of the plaintiffs or any manner interfere with the plaintiff's rights and authorities in the administering the provision of section 4 subsection 2 of the stamp duty act cap s8 laws of the federation of nigeria the document explained the sought the court to declare the entitlement to receive 85 percent of stamp duties generated from electronic money transfer levies and others they demanded a declaration that the plaintiffs are entitled to 85 percent of all stamp duties collected on electronic money transfer levy on electronic receipts or electronic transfer of money deposited in deposit money banks and financial institutions or on any type of account to be accounted for and expressed to be received by the person to whom the transfer or deposit is made in the plaintiff's respective states. What is your thought about this that has been said? What is your own reaction to this present situation as we can see? The attorneys general in Nigerian Texas states have sued the attorney general of the Federation and Minister of Justice Abubakar Malami for non remittance of stamp duties funds generated from the state. What is your thought about this? According to the court documents, the attorney sued Malami because funds generated from stamp duties are not remitted into the state's coffers. People's Gazette reports. What is your thought about this? As we can see, the state attorney general has now sued Nigerian's attorney general Malami over non remittance of over 176 billion naira from stamp duties 
What is your own reaction to this? I would like you to drop your thoughts and reaction via the comment section on the spending development. I would like you to share your own reaction with us on this, but before we go, let's people's reactions and in their thoughts about this. Let's see what people have felt concerning the present situation of things in Nigeria. Peter Pete reacted to this and said, The problem with Africa is that those who have ideas have no power, and those with power have completely no ideas. What is your thought about this? Those who have been bestowed with ideas have no power to be able to share their ideas, but those that are in power have no little of ideas. That is what Peter has said. What is your thought about this? What is your own reaction to this that has been said that those who have ideas don't have power? Why those who are in power doesn't have any idea? What is your own reaction to this? You know, according to what Peter has said, if our leaders have ideas, they will have been able to come over this issue, the devil in the country for a very long time. They will have been able to overrun all this issue of banditry activities, all this issue of kidnappings. All this issue of insecurity in this country, they will have been able to overcome it, but due to lack of ideas, they have not been able to do anything positively to call all this. What is your thought about this that Peter have said? Well, let's move forward and see what other people's reactions is about this. Angu reacted to this and said, So, all those stamp duties, guaranteed trust, has been that I've been collecting, from my account since 2015 have not been remitted to the Federation's account. Malami should tell us what happened, please. What is your thought about this? We have heard what Angu has said, saying that all those stamp duties guarantee trust that have been collected from his account since 2015 till now have not been remitted. It was not remitted to the Federation's account. He said Malami should tell us what happened, please. What is your thought about this? You know, Sairoma Yonin have also reacted to this and said, This and more, you know, many more reasons why the public service isn't managed in Nigeria. You can imagine the effrontery of a man and where he is. Employers, if I may ask, what is your thought about this? Imagine the effrontery, you know, that Malami has to keep the stamp even the you know the stamp funds even when he has no right to do that what is your thought about this all these funds generated from stamp duties were not remitted how come that is what people have been saying what is your own reaction to this that has been said i would like you to drop your thoughts on this don't forget that the attorney general have now sued nigerians attorney general malami over the non-remittance of over 176 billion naira from stamp duties, we like you to share on thought about this. Obviously, all this corruption we you know we are talking about among Nigerians is not only among the citizens alone, but among even the leaders in Nigeria. People that are in power are also fond of this corruption. And if our leaders should be doing this, tell me how do you expect the citizens to be clean? I would like you to drop your thoughts on this. Thank you guys for listening. Do subscribe to this channel if you have not. And I will see you on the other news. Bye for now.